What is up guys, welcome back to the channel, this is Dr. Hamastek. So today we'll be doing a speed, RAM, temperature and a Geekbench test between two Ultra phones here in 2021. In the first corner here, we have the Galaxy S21 Ultra. It's coming with the Exynos 2100 and this model here, it does come with 12 gigs of RAM and 256 gigs of storage. And in the other corner here, we have the other Ultra phone. This is from Xiaomi and it is the Xiaomi Mi 11 Ultra. It comes with the Snapdragon 888 and it also also comes with 12 gigs of RAM and 256 gigs of storage. So before we start, let's check out those room temperatures over here. 30.5 and let's check out those phones. 36. 35.9 so not much difference at all. So what we're going to do here in the first part is boot these two phones up. And what I notice is that usually Xiaomi phones tend to have a faster boot up than most Android phones. So let's see here with the Mi 11 Ultra. This test definitely I've been waiting to do in 2021. The best from Snapdragon up against the best from the Exynos. All right, as you can see there, Mi 11 Ultra right into it. Let's give some the S21. Yeah, get it's already done right there. All right, and let's see these two phones. Let's check out those calendars already here. Well, this one does take some time to load up. Let's give it some time. Yeah, as you can see there, the Mi 11 Ultra when it comes to booting up is super, super fast. All right, and just to show you guys, all apps have been closed on both of these two phones. And also both of these two phones are connected to the same Wi-Fi network as well. And only the location is on on both of these two phones. Also the display on both these phones, 120 Hz and HD+. You don't have to worry about any uh, biasness over there. And so these are the apps that we are going to test out in this speed test. Do also note that both of these two phones, the battery have been charged up to 100%. As you can see there, it has already gone down by 2%. So let's get the speed test running. All right, it seems like the Mi 11 Ultra does have a slight lead. And as you can see there, Mi 11 Ultra with the S21 Ultra just behind it by a few seconds. Let's check out those temperatures. Forgot to do that at the start. 36.5, 36.2. Let's go to the next one here, Pokemon Go. Also do know that the game turbo has been disabled on both of these two phones. Again, the Mi 11 Ultra with the S21 Ultra just right behind it. Next one here, YouTube. Faster on the S21. Next up here, Instagram. Similar on both phones. PUBG Mobile. This is a very big app to open. Looks like the Mi 11 Ultra. And there you have it, Mi 11 Ultra right into it. The S21 just behind it as well. So as you see, when it comes to the Exynos 2100, massive improvements. Let's check out those temperatures. 37.4, 36.4. So yes, a massive difference in terms of, uh, in terms of just temperature. All right. As you can see there, massive difference in terms of temperature. Next one here, Facebook. All right, over here, Shopee, similar on both phones, YouTube Music, similar, settings, similar again, I just ignited. All right, neck and neck, Premier League, similar again, Netflix, all right, similar. Let's go to the camera app. All right. Okay, faster on the 11 Ultra. Let's go to TikTok. All right, similar on both phones. Photoshop. 
similar on both phones again. Let's go to Twitter. All right, similar on both phones. Very, very impressive. All right. And all right, so we are done with that. And let's check out those temperatures. 37.7, 37.0. So a bit of difference between both of these two phones. Now let's do a RAM test over here. All right, very impressive. Both phones with that 12 gigs of RAM. Next one here, Genshin Impact. Also held out very, very well. 12 gigs of RAM really does help. Let's go to PUBG Mobile. As you can see there, no refreshes at all. Let's go to Twitter. All right, very good. Let's go to Instagram. No refreshes as well. Let's go to YouTube. No refreshes as well. So let's check out those temperatures again. 38.4, massive. 37.7. So all right, let's just close up all the apps before we start the Geekbench test. All right, let's check out the Geekbench over here. And these are the stats. Do note that both of these two phones, they do have their dark mode. For some reason, Xiaomi always just pushes it to every other app. All right, so before we start the benchmark test, let's check out those temperatures. 36.9, gone down quite a bit. And 36.7, so all right, it's pretty equal. So let's start this benchmark test. Do note the battery is over here still at 100%, whereas over here has gone down to 97%. All right, so let's run this benchmark test and I'll see you guys in a bit. All right, so now we are at the halfway mark, 51%, and of course, the, the S21 Ultra way behind this. Let's check out those temperatures. 36.8, 36.8. So yes, in terms of uh, temperature management, pretty good on the S21 Ultra, but of course, when it comes to just raw performance, here is just waiting. Battery, do note, is at still at 100%, whereas over here is at 96. And of course, this could be a soft waiting trying to overshow the battery. So again, I'll see you guys at the end of this test when we get to see the results. Okay, so as we are nearing towards the end, as you can see here with the Mi 11 Ultra way ahead of the S21 Ultra. In the last test up against the Poco F3, it gave me very good results, over 1000. Let's see what we get here, 1087 and a multi-core score of 3226. So yes, very, very good scores indeed when it comes to all these management scores. With the S21 Ultra, it does take some time. So let's just take out the temperatures over here, just right after the results, 37.2, very, very good indeed. And let's check out here with the S21 Ultra. Let's give it some time. It would definitely need some time. In the last result, it did give me quite a satisfying result, not the best, I would say. So let's just hope uh, with some software improvements and updates it has improved and let's just get it over there 617 multi-core score very very disappointing here on the galaxy s21 ultra let's check out those temperatures over here 37.5 and over here 37.2 so not much difference in terms of temperature but you can see here raw performance definitely the snapdragon phone wins so yes if you guys did find this video helpful and you did enjoy this do click the like and smash the subscribe button down below for more videos like this in the future do also follow me on my social as well on twitter instagram facebook and also here on youtube at dr hamistake so that is it this is dr hamistake stay safe take care and wash those hands